how to get mods on Minecraft Xbox One. What's going on guys? It is Hemi Jarvis. In today's video, that's exactly what I want to show you. I want to show you how to get mods on Minecraft. Okay? This is the Xbox One edition. For all of you guys out there who have an Xbox One console and is playing Minecraft right now, this video is specifically for you. Alright? I'm going to break the video down into probably three separate parts because I don't want the videos to be too long for you guys, right? So this is going to be part number one. Uh, part number two, part number three, I will be making it pretty soon. I will have links in the description where you can go to part two and part three and so forth. But um, yeah, so step number one, let's jump right into the video. I don't want to make the videos too long, so I'm just going to get right into the actual details on what you need to do to start uh, putting mods in, in, in Minecraft on your Xbox. So anyway, first thing you want to do, guys, um, if you already have Minecraft downloaded, uh, the first thing you want to do is go up here uh, to, well, what you can do is click the X on your uh, Xbox controller, in the middle of your Xbox controller, and you want to go down to My Games and Apps, as you can see here. You click on My Games and Apps, then you're going to go to See All, all right? Uh, once you hit See All, um, you're going to go down to Apps, and there are two apps that you're going to need in order to make this happen. So if you want to get the mods on Minecraft uh, using your Xbox, these are the two apps that you're going to, going to need to make that happen. The first app will be Foul downloader it's called file downloader file downloader all right that's number one that's the first app that you need the second app that you're going to need is called ufo transfer if you want to um get the apps all you do is go up to the search bar and type it in type in file downloader and uh ufo transfer and download them both to your um xbox now once you have the two apps downloaded, the third step in this video series, um, part one, is to go up here to uh, Microsoft Edge. It's what they call it. It's basically Internet Internet Explorer, but Microsoft Edge is what they call it on your Xbox. So go ahead and go there. All right. Now, once you clicked Microsoft Edge, um, you're going to uh, go to a page that looks, let me show you what website you got to go to. This is the page you're supposed to be on, but wait, don't do not do nothing. Just wait, wait, don't do nothing. You don't got to do nothing right now. I'm about to start from the beginning. Hold on. All right, so you want to go up to your browser and you want to type in this website right here that you see, uh, mcpedl.com slash mutant creatures add-on that's the website you need to get on all right so why did i just do that but that's the website you want to go to all right so come on computer my computer acting funny anyway let me click on it hold on well not my computer but my xbox but anyway here it is all right so that's the address once you get on this website, you're just going to scroll down, all the way down, all the way down. Keep going down. Go down some more. Down, 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 the down, down. All the way down. Down by the river, go a hank the bank. And then a boom. Here it is. Change log. Right on the change log, you should see installation. What you want to do is clip on, click on you can get a zip file for this add-on here. So click that. And again, I'm going to make this video a three-part series or, or maybe even a four- to five-part series because I don't want the videos to be too long for you guys. I don't want it to be overwhelming. But anyway, once you get on this page here, uh, what you need to do now is just hover your mouse over the download button and click on the three dots i mean the three lines on your xbox one controller basically click the start button so boom shakalaka now 
what you need to do is copy the link so scroll down until you see copy link and just hit a copy the link now once you copy this link all you have to do is click the middle button of your Xbox controller again and then go back into file downloader all right so it should be right here but if you need if it's not right here on this menu just go to my games and apps see all and then scroll down to apps and there it is file downloader all right so once you get inside a file downloader it shouldn't look like this hold on hold on i done did some other stuff anyway once you get on file downloader you're going to go to these three dots on the top left corner and you're going to go to from url so click on from url and once you do that you're going to uh Hold on, make sure I don't want to mess up nothing for y'all because I've been on here doing stuff already. Uh, it should have been some other folders here. I don't know why. This is not right. Hold on, something's not right. Oh, here they are. So if you got the folders that look like this, this is how y'all y'all things should look. Um, go to local storage. All right. So you see where my mouse is? Just look at my mouse. Boom, local storage. All right, once you click local storage, you want to click on the the uh the uh this right here and delete everything that's in the box. So, hold on. I'm just going to click undo real quick. Uh, okay. So, hover over this and click the three lines on your Xbox One controller, the start button basically. Just hit start and go to paste you're going to paste the url that you just copied from the website in here then once you hit paste you're in your local storage right destination path and name local storage right what you want to do is hit this down arrow it's important that you do that hit the down arrow all right as you can see i just hit the down arrow now once you hit the down arrow you can now hit the start button so it can download it for you and as you can see, it is downloading here. It shouldn't take too long. Um, it should take, you know, less than a minute. <laughs> it shouldn't take too long. It should take less than a minute, guys. All right. As you can see here, I already got it on my computer, so it's not letting me download it twice. But yours should be downloaded. All right. Once you got down, I'm going to hit cancel. You don't got to do this. I'm going to hit cancel. All right. Now, once it's downloaded on your computer, the next step will be to go back up to these three dots up here that you see on the top left corner of your computer. And, you know, you want to go to uh, storage, all right, because you just downloaded. Go to storage, all right. I don't know why my eyes look like this. But let me see. But you go to storage and then you should click on the uh thing here my it shouldn't say oh yeah click on that yeah hold on go back dang i go back all right so you're going to click on the uh what they call it the add-on that you just added on which is right here it's mutant creatures v6 so you click on that hit a on it and then you'll see these two folders here you're going to click on both of those boom boom that's one and two um so once you click both of those uh what did i do i believe you hit copy yeah you copy it and then after you hit copy you hit up and then you're going to create a folder right here so name it whatever you want i'm just going to name this g g g g all right and then hit start then see I think the video has got a little too long already Hold on, I'm gonna make it a little more longer than I'm gonna do part two I'm gonna stop it and do part two but uh hold on hold on just a minute I'm trying to read something real quick
all right so all right so you're going to click on the three lines on the bottom here and then you're going to go to new folder all right now you want to once you go to new folder you want to paste the files all right so i think this is the paste button all right you paste the files boom so now the files are in the actual folder. Now you want to go into your settings. I'm going to show you guys that stuff in the next video. This is part number one. Um, you know, I know this video is kind of getting a little bit too long, so I'm going to do part two in a minute. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you want to see part two. Uh, you know sooner than later uh i'm gonna get right on it but if you want me to upload it asap go ahead and hit that thumb up button be sure to subscribe to the to the youtube channel because here on my channel i'll be giving away um xbox live gold codes time from time i gave away one like last month i think that was yeah it was last month you can see the video on that uh on my channel somewhere but yeah absolutely free i do real giveaways live 100 percent but that's aside from this video. Um, I'm going to do part two for you guys. Right now, I'm going to stop this video right here. I don't want it to get too long because I don't want to overwhelm you. But do those first steps. Uh, I'm going to put the link to part two in the description. Uh, be sure to check that out. <clears throat> and, yeah, I'm going to see y'all guys, you guys in part number two. Uh, shout out to everybody that's playing Minecraft right now. I got an Xbox One console. And I'll be playing Minecraft, like one of my favorite games. But anyway, I ain't going to make this video too long. Let me get out of here. Uh, you guys, be sure to subscribe. And I'm going I'm to shoot part two for you guys. Go ahead, get this video to 10,000 likes. Uh, that's the goal for this video. I'll see you guys soon.